down. What is up, YouTube? It's your boy Breezy Cakes, the Sneaker Fiend. Now, today we're going over the Jordan 1 in the patina colorway, patina colorway. I don't really know. In this video, I will be reviewing the sneaker, showing you what it looks like on feet, as well as doing a lace swap. And I will get into resale. I'm not gonna lie, I'm very surprised on the prices this shoe is going for currently. And I think a lot of people are gonna sleep and they're gonna regret it. But we'll get into that later in the video. For now, if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe hit that like button if you like the content and follow me on instagram at breezy underscore cakes 23 so with that being said let's get it <laughs> and bam the jordan one patinas now this shoe here i have heard so much crap on from people who don't even have the shoe in hand People looking at the first images that came out, they instantly just jumped to, oh, that's a trash shoe, it looks garbage, blah, 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 all this BS. But as far as all the people I've seen review the sneaker and actually have them in hand, they've had pretty much nothing but good things to say about this shoe. I'm just really surprised there's so many people talking crap on this shoe without even having it in hand. It's just funny to me. Cause looking at the sneaker in person, it's straight fire. Got this very nice buttery leather, just so soft to the touch, especially the suede material in the back. Soft suede, you guys can see the lines running my finger across it. So nice quality for sure. So you got black leather up on the heel, the underlays, so up in the toe box, where you have this like faded copper type look to the leather on the overlays. And then your heel section, you do have this olive colored suede now pictures don't do this shoe justice this is definitely a sneaker that looks way better in person now you do have a black tongue up at the top of the tongue you have this nike air tag and you got the like green stitching running around it i'm thinking one reason people are hating on the shoe is because this tag isn't that like og look and it's not wrapped around the top which i kind of get but at the same time like i don't think this is a bad look at all I am kind of curious on why Jordan Brand decided to do that. Now you have a white midsole and solid black outsole. Now I did already throw on these green laces. So it came with black and green laces, which I think they both look nice. I think you can't go wrong with either. I think if you throw on some white laces, that would look really nice as well. So with that being said, let's look at these bad boys on feet. And bam, let me know what you guys think of this shoe on foot. Which was your favorite set of laces? Comment that down below. Now, let's get into resale. So like I mentioned, this shoe is currently going for around 230 to 250 on places like StockX. And the shoe hasn't even released yet, which I'm completely shocked with those prices because I think this shoe is worth a lot more. When it comes to the sneaker game, you kind of know which shoes are gonna have good resell, which ones aren't. I've been in it for a while, and this is a shoe that I thought for sure was gonna have some really good resell. But for some reason, this shoe just is doing low prices right now, which has happened before in the past where people, you know, they listen to their 
favorite influencer and what they think and everyone goes off of that and they say they don't like it and then once it drops people get it in hand a lot of people regret it then they start chasing the shoe and it caused for almost like a reversed effect so realistically at the moment i can see this shoe going for around that 250 price range after release and depending on how people react once they get them in hand you know it really is a tough one to tell because i personally could see this shoe hitting that 300 dollars price range and higher my resale predictions honestly are kind of in the air i don't really know what to think it's kind of one of those things where you just gotta sit and wait but nonetheless this shoe does have resale value let me know what you guys think in the comments below if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe hit that like button if you like the content follow me on instagram at breezy underscore kicks 23 that being said, it's your boy Breezy Kicks. We out. I don't trust no one but in God that we trust, nigga. If we getting rated, everything is getting flush. I done had 12 through that shit more than once, nigga. If I gotta go and make a move, best believe it's getting done. Uh, best believe it's getting done. Huh? Best believe it's getting done. I don't trust no one but in God that we trust, nigga. If we getting rated, everything is getting flush. I done had 12 through that shit more than once.